Saudi Arabia's new $29 billion airport is set to change the nation's future. At least, that's what the government and engineers are counting on. Imagine an airport designed to maintain its title as the world's largest, with an annual capacity of 185 million passengers. The infrastructure feels like something straight out of a science fiction movie thanks to the significant use of the Internet of Things, IoT, robotics, and artificial intelligence. These technologies promise to revolutionize operations and provide an unparalleled level of hospitality and efficiency. This enables the airport to open doors to a whole new world, offering world-class operations and an unprecedented level of service. This is just the beginning. There's so much more to uncover about this mega airport. What's even more intriguing is this question. Is this airport truly worth its $29 billion price tag? Stick around to find out. $29 billion, new world's biggest airport. Unveiled in 2022, the King Salman International Airport project is located in Riyadh, the capital city of Saudi Arabia. Upon its completion in 2030, the airport is expected to become one of the world's largest. But why does Saudi Arabia need a new airport, especially the busiest one? What's even more remarkable is the project's cost. There are many successful airport construction projects that came in below this price. For example, Mexico City's new international airport, NAICM, is an engineering Marvel worth $13.3 billion, attracting worldwide attention with its innovative passenger services, including self-service check-in, biometric boarding, and more. Then, why does the Saudi government plan to invest $29 billion in the new airport? Clearly, the days when kings had the authority to announce extravagant building projects at a whim simply to appeal themselves or their loved ones are long gone. That would sound ridiculous in today's world. Fortunately, modern engineering projects are based on strategic planning and technical depth. And this one is no exception. Given the future demands of the aviation industry, taking such massive action has become essential for the Saudi government. The country has a plethora of airports for its population size, with King Fahd International Airport already holding the status of the world's largest. However, Saudi Arabia is not well connected to the rest of the world, so most passengers need to fly through competitive hubs to reach the country. The authorities are determined not to let the country's global presence fade, especially given the other needs tied to its massive development. As part of the Vision 2030 plan, the government aims to increase Riyadh's population to around 15 to 20 million. The estimated metro area population of Riyadh in 2024 is 7,820,550 meaning the Saudi government has set a goal to at least double the population in just six years. The plan also has the potential to boost tourism, with the aim of attracting more than 40 million visitors. The construction of a massive new airport with state-of-the-art facilities will play a key role in promoting tourism and, in turn, boosting the country's GDP. King Fahd International Airport recently set a new record, attracting 12 million passengers from January to mid-December 2020 a 15% increase compared to 2023. Saudi Arabia has even bigger plans. Imagine the record rising to 185 million passengers. This is truly unbelievable. However, as we discussed earlier, this is the primary goal behind Saudi Arabia's development of the world's largest airports. As soon as this estimated number was released, discussions began to circulate on social media. Enthusiasts of exciting mega construction projects didn't let a single detail slip by. If you're one of them, make sure to subscribe to our channel. We'll be featuring even more jaw-dropping construction projects, and you won't want to miss them. The Future of Aviation in Saudi Arabia the $29 billion airport is set to transform the aviation industry in the future. Built over the existing King Khalid International Airport, it'll span 57 square kilometers, 22 square miles. As reported by CNN, the project will be designed by the renowned British architecture studio Foster & Partners. While you might not immediately recognize their name, Foster & Partners is the largest architectural firm in the UK and has earned numerous awards for excellence in the civil industry. This ambitious project, which they have dubbed Aerotropolis, is poised to attract even more attention and solidify their reputation in the field. The video focuses on the airport, but if you'd like a more detailed video on the incredible records of Foster & Partners, let us know in the comments.
On their official website, Foster & Partners mentioned that this project will help Riyadh enhance its position as a global logistics hub. The airport will serve as a bridge linking the east with the west, stimulating transport, trade, and tourism. Head of studio Luke Fox promised that the airport will reimagine the traditional terminal as a single concourse loop served by multiple entrances. The terminal is very much of its place and connects passengers to the sensory experiences of the city. With natural elements, tempered light, and state-of-the-art facilities. The King Salman International Airport Development Company, KSIADC, has also announced collaborations with Jacobs, Mace, and the Saudi company Nara to ensure that the result is truly impressive. Before reaching its ultimate goal of handling 185 million passengers annually by 2050, the airport will first be able to accommodate 120 million passengers per year upon its completion in 2030. By 2050, the airport will also have the capacity to process 3.5 million tons of cargo. Achieving such capacity is no small feat, which is why the project's being built over the existing King Khaled International Airport and is expected to include at least six parallel runways upon completion. The massive capacity is impressive, but there's another important aspect to consider in this mega project. Will engineers be able to embrace sustainability principles to avoid potential controversies? It's essential for engineering projects to be sustainable in order to create a better world, opening the door to long-lasting, efficient systems for future generations. While things may evolve over time, reports indicate that the project is expected to be as sustainable as any building in the aviation industry can be. The new airport is set to achieve LEED Platinum certification by utilizing renewable energy and implementing cutting-edge green initiatives in its infrastructure. The plan not only focuses on physical infrastructure and sustainability, but also aims to provide outstanding travel experiences by incorporating cutting-edge technologies. Based on our analysis, artificial intelligence, robotics, and the Internet of Things IoT, should be the key components components of future construction projects. Linda Shercroft, Vice President of Innovation and Customer Experience at King Salman International Airport, emphasized the importance of these technologies for the upcoming airport. We can't open a world-class airport without using all these things. We are setting the foundation and building our digital infrastructure to not only be able to handle AI, IoT, sensors, robots, and autonomous movers, but also to handle emerging technology of the future that we can't even anticipate will be here in 2040. Indeed, Saudi Arabia has the potential to truly transform the passenger experience. Imagine an airport with autonomous people movers. You wouldn't have to worry about directions. You could sit back, relax, and enjoy the journey and the breathtaking scenery around you as it effortlessly takes you to your destination. This is something straight out of a science fiction movie. Scenes we could only once imagine. The future airport will be as convenient as possible, bridging the gap between the physical world and the customer travel experience. Shoecroft invites tourists to imagine an amazing journey where they can pre-order their favorite Starbucks drink or select souvenirs for their families the night before their trip, all through a single platform. When customers arrive, these items will be waiting for them, ensuring a warm welcome. Say goodbye to frustrating queues and imagine enjoying your trip without unnecessary hassles. This mega airport won't let you feel bored either. Roughly 12 square kilometers will be dedicated to recreational facilities and retail space. Instead of waiting for your flight, you can spend quality time shopping. Seif A. Baha Eldon, senior partner at Foster & Parents, said, This visionary development will play an important role in shaping the city into a global hub of creativity and innovation. Given everything we've discussed, there's no doubt that the project has the potential to significantly impact the country's economy. It's expected to contribute approximately 27 billion riles, more than $7 billion, annually to the kingdom's non-oil GDP. Additionally, the project is expected to create 103,000 direct and indirect jobs, helping many people achieve their goals. 
So, we believe the project is worth the $29 billion investment, from an annual capacity of 185 million passengers to the incredible features introduced through cutting-edge technology, everything is truly jaw-dropping. What are your thoughts on this? Let us know in the comments. We have many more exciting construction projects to share with you. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any of them.